what's your prognosis for gold and silver in this environment? Well, the, you know, the, the gold and silver market is rigged just like the bond market and the stock market. Uh, it can't go anywhere as long as the Federal Reserve is prepared to sell naked shorts. As long as they can short uh, gold and silver in, in the COMEX market, they can dump huge amounts of, of paper contracts that drive the price down, uh, they can keep it capped. Uh, they can't keep it capped if the dollar goes in the terms of other countries saying, we have lost confidence, we don't want these dollars, we're getting out of them. If, <clears throat> if they do that, then the Fed no longer can rig any market. And if that happens, the gold and silver price is unpredictable. It could be anything. It could go well, to the upside. Oh, yeah. I mean, it, it could... <sighs> It could skyrocket beyond anybody's expectations. Ten thousand an ounce, seven thousand an ounce for gold. Who knows? I mean, you, you get a you get a real collapse of the dollar. It could be uh, thirty thousand an ounce or more. I mean, who knows? There's a huge supply of dollars in the world. It's been the dollars have been pumped out into the world ever since. Uh, Bretton Woods, when the United States took the reserve currency role away from Great Britain after World War II. When the World War II exhausted the British, they couldn't hold on to the uh, reserve currency role, and the pound was, just, was displaced by the dollar. Well, ever since, the United States has been pumping dollars out. They're everywhere. They're, the world is drowning in them. And, and so there's such a huge supply if the world lost confidence and said, well, let's get out of them. There's nothing to buy them up with. 